A good day to you. I am feeling on top of the world. And do you know why? I am feeling on top of the world. Do you know why? Because today I have produced my 80th video. Today is the 80th video that I have produced on this YouTube channel known as Motivating Force. Of course, I produced more than that. But 80 videos just on Motivating Force. It's day 38. Ladies and gentlemen, how do you feel when you achieve something? Wonderful, isn't it? Top of that world feeling. Persistence, consistency, and a desire to continue no matter what happens is what has pulled me, kept me going. We must have a greater purpose in life. Do something that is of value to others. That's my aim today. Ladies and gentlemen, in one year, we have 12 months. In a year, we have 365 days. Each, each day, you can send a positive thought to someone. How would the other person feel? How does that make you feel? Absolutely wonderful. It's like being on top of the world. That feeling is what you will get. Every day is an important day for us. What we do today determines our future. Today we sow the seeds. Tomorrow we'll reap the rewards. That's how life is. I believe that everyone has an inborn talent which they need to develop further. It could be singing, it could be writing, it could be producing videos, it could be playing a game, it could be leading, it could be sewing, it could be cooking, and so forth. It does not matter what talent you have, but all of us have one talent that we can bring up to the world. Many people do not realize that they have been cheating on themselves. In the book, See You at the Top by Zig Zackler, See You at the Top by Zig Zackler, he shares of a thief who went to many houses and stole money, wealth from them. Eventually, he was caught and later he reformed. He went to a village, a remote village and lived there. After a while, they realized it. He was that famous thief. And again, his reputation became tarnished. But people were so used to him because he was no longer the crooked guy he was. He had reformed and become a good guy. They asked him one question. Who was the person from whom you stole the most? Who was the person from whom you stole the most? And he said, the person from whom I stole the most is... Myself, the person from whom I stole the most is myself. He explained that he had actually wasted a good portion of his life by stealing. And by stealing, he had been a lazy person who had not developed his own talent, not done something for him, his family and others in society. In short, he said, I wasted 30 years of my life stealing from others. If I had not stolen from others and focused on my own life, I could have got a college degree. I could have become a top businessman. I could have contributed a lot to society. Therefore, ladies and gentlemen, my question to you is that, are you doing something that is preventing you from being the best you can be? From being best to be better? From being a better person to do great things? Has there been occasions, people telling you, I wished I had done that 20 years ago. I wished I had done 30 years ago. My wish for you is that you don't have to say that 30, 40 or 50 years from now, because 
you are no longer going to do that you should tell yourself today i am going to transform myself and do that one thing that i wanted to do for myself my family and the world by focusing on that and not giving excuses such as i am too old i am too young i am too rich i am too poor too uneducated too over educated i don't have the time and so forth instead just tell yourself i am doing this for myself my family and everyone in society and go forth and do it just do it it can be achieved success is not achieved by shortcuts success is not achieved by shortcuts it's achieved by consistency persistency and self reliance including overcoming the odds being resilient so go ahead and do what you had wanted to do a long time ago this is day 38 this is day 38 and my request to you is that do what you can be the best you can and you will be a light to shine in the lives of others someone who can delight others and you will be feeling much more elated by doing that thank you this is distinguished those master prema kumar i shall see you again tomorrow Thank you.